Welcome to the Daily Dad Podcast, where we provide one lesson every day to help you with your most important job, being a dad. These are lessons inspired by ancient philosophy, by practical wisdom, and insights from dads all over the world. Thank you for listening, and we hope this helps. Don't judge them too harshly or quickly. In the spring of 1921, a young ball player named Louis Gehrig had a tryout for the great John McGraw at the Polo Grounds. McGraw was the manager of the Giants and one of the greatest evaluators of talent in the history of the game. It was a good tryout. Gehrig hit a few deep balls. He was lively and quick. He was already showing off his almost inhumanly large lower body, which was key to his power at the plate. But then Gehrig headed to first base, where he promptly let an easy ball go through his feet. And according to biographers, the tryout ended almost immediately. McGraw had seen all he needed to see. We might call this moment McGraw's folly. In an instant, he sized up and judged this kid, and Gehrig was a kid, painfully shy, sheltered, inexperienced, and promptly missed out on the career of one of the game's greatest talents, and human beings. Gehrig would go on to play first base for the Yankees, hit hundreds of home runs, win multiple World Series, and play the longest streak of consecutive starts in the history of the game. Maybe he would have been worth a little more attention, a little more patience, and a slightly more open mind. It's essential that we learn from these misses when it comes to talent. People are ciphers, even our own kids. We're not nearly as good at evaluating ability and predicting the future as we think we are. So we have to be forgiving. We can't jump to conclusions. We have to give kids the benefit of the doubt. We are better off being Jim Volvano's father than we are Jim McGraw. Root for somebody. Don't write them off. Take another look. Expect great things from your kids and their kids. Hey, thanks for listening to the Daily Dad podcast. You can get this via email every day as well at dailydad.com. Please leave us a review in iTunes. Most importantly, If you know any dads or parents who would benefit from these messages, please spread the word. Thanks.